All right, we're back to hijacking Stella Zone, the first season we have with me, Chef Kwame here. I'm here. We got our aprons on. We got our special Stella Zone aprons. And we are ready to make some shrimp tacos. So let's begin. So what are we doing today? We're making some shrimp tacos. Shrimp tacos. Yeah, it's on the list of what we have to eat this week. So, so we have... Some shrimp. Some shrimp already yeah, I mean, thawed, yeah, out, yeah, thawed out. Already cleaned up. Cleaned up with and some uh, orange juice and some garlic on it. Just for some garlic and put on it. Alright, and what else we got in there? What's what's uh is that some pepper on there? Yeah, we got some pepper and some salt, just a little bit of that. A little bit of salt and pepper, that's, okay. That's only to use the marinade. So what are we doing on this so, baking tray here? So we're gonna be adding some oil. That's what all our veggies are in order. Tortilla. Alright, we're painting yeah, painting the, the shrimp. Yeah, just some oil and uh, what do we need to set this oven at? But we're gonna bake it at 320 because we don't overcook stuff, we want the crunchiness on that stuff in our tortilla. Adding our veggies on top. Yeah. It's all gonna add the flavor. We got some freshly chopped red onions. That has a lot of onions. Yeah. Alright, we got our red peppers. And what else we got? Oh man, we got so many peppers. We got green peppers, we got red peppers. Oh, these are orange peppers here, if you can't tell. In case you're colorblind. Mm, again, all that color equals all that flavor. Added into the shrimp there. Gonna be rolled up in some tortillas that we got over here. They're also gonna put on this baking sheet just to heat up in the oven. No, we're not going to fry them open like that. We're going to close them up. We're going to close them up in this foil. So stay tuned. All right, so here's our spices we're going to add to this shrimp and veggie mix here. We've got some uh, ground chili pepper. We've got some pe smoked paprika, excuse me. We've got some garlic. We've got onion powder, some cumin, and of course here, good old salt and pepper. So we're going to add these all. These on. And garlic. Our cumin, and lastly our salt and pepper. Nice. And now we're gonna mix it. Yeah. Just gonna here. Yeah, mix it up, and then can we use our hands? Yeah, hands. Like, you gotta Make sure you wash your hands. hands. It's always fun you mix things with your hands. You know, you really get involved with your food. You kind of get a connection with that food, and so you'll enjoy it more when you eat it. Cause he's like, yeah. We really got into it. Always make sure to salt bay your, your meals. <laughs> Alright, so we got all of our spices mixed in. We uh, actually added a bit more spice to just the uh, shrimp and then separ by separating them then re-adding them back in. But uh, and if you guys can smell this, you know it's going to taste good. And it looks so colorful and delicious. So our oven is preheated at 320. We're going to uh, add the tortillas that are right here. And we're going to uh, heat this up for how long, Junior? Mm -hmm. uh, so we're going to, let's say, we heat the tortillas up, let's say, five minutes. And then we'll take it out because we're going to make sure we get the oil off it by, you know. Okay, so we're only going to heat the tortillas for a few minutes, yeah, but yeah, how long are we going to keep the rest of it in? So let's say, uh, you know, we're going to, let's say we'll give it about 15 minutes. Uh, we're going to check it every single five minutes to make sure the shrimp is not cooked. Sounds good. So just so keep an eye on it, yeah. and if we got to put it in longer, yeah. we'll do that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, a little more black pepper. That's good. That's always good. Spice is nice. Yeah. Always use your Stella's own spice. Yeah. We'll have a mix coming for this. Just pull up the over there. Tea on the side there. So well, last thing, oh, guys. Oh, a little more oil just to oil. seal the deal. Mm -hmm. Just your regular olive oil, or canola oil, or vegetable oil, whatever oil. In it goes. All right, we'll be checking it. All right, guys. So we're still at 320. We took out everything, the uh, tortillas out, spread out our veggies and uh, shrimp, and we're gonna let that go for another 15 minutes. And meanwhile, we have our salsa here. So we have uh, fresh cilantro, tomatoes, onions. We're going to add a little bit of lime to that, a little bit of uh, salt and pepper. And then we're going to be frying here. Well, not really frying, but uh, sauteing mm -hmm. our, uh, our tortillas to get them a little bit crispy. And then by the time everything's done, 
we're gonna have us some delicious shrimp tacos. So we're gonna uh, just kind of fry up our uh, tortillas a little bit here because they look a little bit bland. They look a little bit sorry here all by themselves when you get them out of the store. Of course, they're already cooked and ready to go, but we're gonna add just a little bit extra, you know, flavor and toastiness to them. Mm -hmm. So basically we're gonna let them cook on this, uh, on this pan on high heat here just for a little bit until you start to see it, you know, turn brown. And you'll notice it starts to kind of bubble up. When you notice it kind of rising off the pan a little bit, you know that you got the right heat and you only need it on there for a few seconds. See? And then you're ready for the next Give it maybe, maybe 15 seconds. See, it kind of puffs up. Flip it. Give it another 10, 15 seconds. Bubbles up on that side. Boom. See? Perfect. It's like adding grill marks to your hot dogs. It just makes it taste better. <laughs> yeah, not quite pink enough yet on those shrimp, but they're getting there. Four minutes. All right, guys, so we are uh, got 15 minutes in, and looks like we still need a bit more time, so we're going to turn up the heat a bit, maybe broil it for a few minutes just to finish it off. All right, guys, so we just got this out of the oven. We uh, did broil for the last uh, three or four minutes just to seal it up. Everything looks delicious, so maybe total cook time of about, I don't know, half an hour at the most. So we're going to just scoop this up and get on a plate. Alright guys, so here it is, our finished product. We got our tortillas, we have our salsa, we have coleslaw from our other video which you saw. Uh, we have cheese, cholula, cilantro, and the main event, the shrimp and veggies. I think we could technically call this deal plant-based because I'm pretty sure we have more plants here represented than any meat. So we're just going to sit down and enjoy this because we can't take smelling it any longer. So make it yourself. Enjoy.